My name's Lauren, this is Chloe, and we just found our first morel of the season. Da -da -da -da. Da -da 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 -da. Chloe says, hell yeah. Now, I am not gonna pick this little guy because you can see how small he is. Teeny tiny. But that means this area has some promise for delivering morels. I had a feeling that it was a little bit early. I've got some greenery that's coming up. I've had a little bit of rain last week. We're supposed to get more rain tomorrow, which might help, but I kind of want to scope out this area and see if we can find any larger ones. But that is definitely the first little guy that I've seen. Well, cover me in butter and call me a basket. So this is day two of finding a morel, and let me show you what we found. Look at that. Of course, me being me, I forgot to bring a bag, so a uh, dog poop bag. We'll have to do. There she is. The first golden nugget I have collected. Onwards. Another one, ladies and squirrels. So the cool thing is, we've already found two today. We've only been out here for a short... Look at her trying to cop a feel. Her little paws down my shirt. What a slut. I think the rain that we got the other day is helping. I'm excited to see what else we find, especially by that first one that we saw yesterday that was super small. I think I'm gonna go back and pick that one up because um, it did look kind of squished and like, it's not gonna get much bigger anyways. And I wanna see if any other ones popped up over by that one. So, uh, let's see. I call these mice umbrellas because if I were a mouse, if it was raining and storming real bad, I'd stand under it and hold it like a damn umbrella. That's pretty cool. See, even Chloe's like, Mom, I could stand under these in a storm. Why is nature so gosh darn neat? Wow. So we meet again, my friend. This was the first one I saw yesterday that I wasn't gonna pick. I've decided to come back and pick it. This little one was just barely not even really hanging on to its stem. Itty bitty. Don't do drugs, kids. Go out in the woods and look for shrooms. I don't think we're finding any more today. But that's okay. We'll be back. The grind don't stop. Uh -huh. Chloe, you did so good looking for mushrooms today. It is day three looking for morels. Let's see what we can find. We have just hit the motherfucking jackpot. Wow. I spotted one, then I looked around, I spotted a second, and then I spotted a third, and the third one is really big, that's what she said. But it actually is big. It's not just, you know, what she was joking about. It's big. You wanna see it? <laughs> so I spotted this one, and then I spotted this one. Chloe says, oh wow, mom. And then, make sure I'm not stepping on any, I spotted this big boy. What's, oh, a fourth. Oh my God, it's Christmas in April. All right, let's pick this little one. Don't mind my crusty ass hands. I've got eczema and, well, just dry fucking skin. Look at that. All right. Let's go for the big boy. Oh my God. Look at that. Okay, I keep finding more. Okay, so we planned ahead this time and brought a bag. So those are the two. Here's a third. What do you think, Chloe? I don't want you getting sick though, so don't. There's a third. Here's a fourth. This is like a, wow. 
This is so much fun. If this ain't what you're doing on a Friday night, well, I don't know what to tell you. Oh, wow, she had a nice big leaf stuck to her. I just saw another one. All right, Chloe, we're gonna have to scoop you and swoop you. All right, we're gonna keep looking. It's clearly, they are here. All right, set you down for a moment. Another one. Into the bag you go. They are here. Oh my God, there's one right here. How did I miss this? Look at that. It's just like a little bit of growth. I've got some younger trees. Okay, that is one thing I've definitely heard. If you've got a dead tree that's still in the ground, they tend to grow around that. But the big one I found was at the base of whatever this is. Oh, okay, so the big morel that I found was at the base of this tree that has all these little spikes on it. It's hard to see, but all these little pokey spikes. That's what two of them were growing out of. I don't know what that's called. I've seen them though before, but they're really sharp and dangerous. Oh man, so fun. Well, damn, that's way more than I expected to find at all in the whole weekend. What do you think, Chloe? That's pretty cool, huh? How neat is that? Pretty fucking neat. I can't, look at this. Wow. I'm trying to think what else I noticed about this area. So we got the dead tree. We've got growth. And then we've got spiky tree here. Wow, well, I am gonna keep checking out this area more. Did we find some mushrooms? We found one really big one. Oop. Then we found one, two, three, four, five little guys. Just in like a minute. All right, we're gonna be here a while. Look at this big boy. Wow. Are you kidding me? All right, so I put Chloe in the bag because this is definitely a hot spot. I'm seeing like four more. Here, I'll show you guys. So there's one. I'm gonna grab them as I see them because your eyes kind of go cross-eyed at a point. I know I see this one. Oh, <laughs> pop goes the squirrel. Or the weasel. I just walked into a spider web. Look at that beauty. Wow. Oh. Okay, there's another one over this way. I'm caught in a spider web. But that is okay. Oh, we got two. There's two right here. One. In the bag. You go. Two. Look at all these. So this is absolutely wild. I did not expect to find this many. This is nuts. This is awesome. Look at all these. What the heck? Wow. That's pretty fucking sweet. the simple things man being out in woods with a pup looking for mushrooms or antlers or hunting fishing hiking all the outdoor shit it's the best I don't want to leave this spot now and that one or two of them they were big I wonder how big they can get on this one.
a little guy, but he looks kind of dried up, so we're going to take him home. I don't want to spend too much longer here because, like, I have found them in other sections of these woods, so I don't want to overdo it here. That's pretty good. Oh, wow. It just keeps going. Well, I have no idea, to be honest, um, the kind of trees or what made that such a hot spot, but um, I'll have to count. Got my little little bag attached to me. That's a, that's a good amount. So I just counted before we move on to another section. In that one area, I found 14. Right, now I'm gonna give away my secrets because if you have knowledge, you should share it with the damn world. Everyone would be better off. <laughs> not that morel hunting's a big fucking deal. What I'm not finding them by are these. Whatever the hell these are. I'm not seeing, yeah, Chloe says, yeah, yeah, not by there. She's sniffing my mushroom bag. Not finding them by there. Now, if I do at some point find some, I will correct that statement. But for right now, and so far, never found any in this crap. It's not crap. It's beautiful greenery that I don't know what it is because I'm not a nature specimen wizard. But if anyone knows what all this shit is, please comment below. All right, so we checked out a couple of other areas. One is where I had found the very small one, the very first one I found that I decided to leave there, but then I went back and got it the next day because it was kind of Honestly, I don't think it was going to grow much more. The stem was smushed. So I checked there. Wasn't seeing anything. So we are going to go back to the area where we found those 14 or so and see if maybe there's another couple of pockets in that area of the woods. This section of the woods is very different. Um, hard to describe. Definitely more pine on the other side. So we're going to see if we can't find some more. So this is what we found in one section. Isn't that right, Chloe? It's pretty good. The size of some of these. It's pretty cool. Diversity. I'm not saying I'm a wizard, but I found some more. So here we go. Boom, which means, as we know, there's gotta be more. Hmm. And again, it's like, what's around here? It's making these things grow. That's what I wanna learn more about. So if any of you have theories, on where specifically these things grow, or if you just think it's sporadic, let me know. That's that shit I do like. Yes. Well, she wants to say hi. So this is worth saying. Essentially what I'm doing, if I find one, I scoop that one up so I don't end up losing it. Because believe it, I have spotted some and then I look away and I'm like, where the hell did it go? So I spot one, I pick it up, and then I stay in that area for like a minute and I just kind of survey and like look out because I'm finding it's never just one, like I mentioned before. I say that, but I've been standing here for like a couple of minutes and I'm not seeing any more, so time to move on. Got two little friends next to one another. Any other little friends? Give a little scan, little check check. And we're 
we're moving on. Now you can call me a loser, but it's Friday night and I just found a crap ton of morels and I can't wait to go home, order some Chinese food and edit this video. Great Odin's Raven. That's a healthy boy. Look at my. Looks like he got in a freaking fight with a squirrel. Maybe I did. I spy with my little eye. Make sure I'm not stepping any on any rather. Oh, that one looks a little fucked up. I don't think I want that one. <gasps> but I do want you. And you. And go. They're all over. Oh no. What am I gonna do? I'm just gonna take them all. Oh shit, where did it go? I just saw it. See, this is what I mean. Oh. So we just we just found four plus the two back there I just found. So this is me coming back to that same area where I started and got that um, dozen or so. Oh, see, I'm gonna end up. Oh no, I took them out of the dirt. I didn't need to do that. We got five. But see, I, I took like two steps and they're all in the circle. So if you're finding one, look around and also look at it from different angles. All right. Well, I got to put these in my bag because I just found some more. But look, looking, looking good in there. Another one. One more. That one looks kind of fucked up and dry. I'm not gonna get that. No point in yanking it out if we're not gonna cook it up and do something with it. But see, there's. Oh, zoom out a bit. There's some. I, I, again, I don't know if this makes a difference, but there's these down logs. This is kind of what the area looks like little bit of growth, but it's not, you notice it's not like super, super green, like some of those other areas I was showing you where there's mice umbrellas, as I called them, or, you know, that green stuff I was asking you guys what that was. It's just kind of leafy, some down trees, some smaller trees go growing. Is this? No, that's not a spiky tree. But I'm also noticing when you've got little trees growing or little growth, regrowing maybe you're finding them there a lot oh my god I might as well just keep filming at this point in the bag with your homies you shall go this is ridiculous So the other thing I will say is for a lot of those, I was off a trail quite a way, like truly deep in the woods. So I would say if you're on a trail or just starting and you see one, just keep working your way back. Um, I just found another one. I'm not annoyed, I'm excited. Oh shit, there it is. That's cute. That's like real blonde. That's like, it's like me. Wow. Put this one back in the little baggie I just found. At least another one. Yep. Oh, dropsies. This is crazy. This is the most I've ever found. Wow. 
Wow, wow, wow. It's interesting. Some of the tips of them are black and um, they look kind of like dried up, which I'm kind of surprised to see that. golden nugget in the sunset. Well, I think that is all we are going to do for tonight for a couple of reasons. One, the sun is setting and I want to walk Chloe a bit more. Two, I want to give some of these time to grow. I'm going to be coming back over the next week. I know you kind of only have a window of like a week or two. So I'm going to come back, hit the same spot, and maybe we'll get some more of those bigger ones, like the first couple that we found. More to come. Oh man. All right, so just to show you, I spy. Oh, interesting. Remember what I said about not finding them where these are? I retract that statement because here they are I knew I just saw another one yeah that was itty bitty probably should have left that one alone don't yell at me this is my favorite time of day look at that rainbow in the sunlight And then she waddled away. If you're feeling down in the dumps, if you're going through some shit, if you're just having a bad day, get out in nature, go for a walk, go in the woods looking for mushrooms, not the poisonous kind, morels, but just get outside. Even if you don't have someone to go do it with, you know, even if it's only for a short period of time, just make it a point to get outside, get some fresh air, and just enjoy nature, man. It's dope as fuck. I'm not a doctor, but I reckon that the breeze and sunshine and squirrels will save your damn soul. Yeah. <laughs> What's that I smell? Nature. And it smells neat. Shit, we found a squirrel. Whoa. Chloe, do you want to go mushroom hunting again tomorrow? Fuck oh, yeah, boy. And this is day, what is it, four, five? Lucky us, I have spotted a couple already. Spotted another one hiding behind a leaf. Oh, good size. One more. Oh, yeah. That's my best friend. That's my fucking best friend. We're gonna go back to that place where we're at. <laughs> oh wait, it's colder than two mice playing hot pockets in a nice cube tray in the front. Wow, nature is so damn neat.